Good morning, everybody. It's day 133. It's 7:20. I'm all packed up here. Um, the unofficial campsite I stayed at last night. A little fire ring. Another fire ring over there. And you got that widow maker up there. Widow maker up there, which I stayed underneath. Stupid, but yeah, whatever. Um, it was only for 12 hours. <laughs> Uh, so I'm all packed up, ready to go, 720, <sighs> wow. I really want to do 21.6 today, and that's the most that I've ever probably done, so, um, the reason is, is because it's a shelter at 21.6, you know, there's supposed to be rain tonight, so, um, yeah, <laughs> okay. Yeah, 21.6 is the shelter. I mean, there's really no other shelter options. The other shelter option is just really close, you know. I want to say it's like 14 miles, but I don't know. Um, if I do the 21.6 today, you know, I mean, that'll be like a, I think a, like a five mile into town or something like that the next day. Um, I don't even know if I can beat the rain. I don't know if I have enough. I, I just don't know. So, I mean, it's been a rough week just because I feel like the uphills have been really tough. Tougher than usual. I don't, I mean, even right now, I mean, it's just, I feel like my legs are just so weak. Um, it's, it's food. I've eaten more food than I've ever eaten on this hike. So, uh, I definitely need to get to town and eat some real food and as much as I can get. Which is always a struggle because you get there and you got to do all this stuff. And uh, you only have so much time in town, you know. So, of course I could take a zero. Get all the extra calories from the zero. But, you know, I mean, that really... I can take a zero or two still if I want to. but And I might. Who knows? Uh, Elevation-wise today... I think it was... God. 3,200? Or 3,700? It was one of those two. So... This be cloudy, I think, today, mostly not too cold out right now I'm even wearing a rain jacket so I think there's really just one big mountain today and then the rest is like baked in so I don't think today is gonna be too terribly hard but I'm already huffing and puffing so um Excited to get into town tomorrow for just all the normal stuff that I need to get done. <sighs> Parisburg, I'm gonna stay, probably stay at a Marriott, but I haven't even checked. I'm pretty sure there's one there, but I haven't checked. I didn't have service last night. Okay, I'm gonna hang it up and uh, See if I can get warm and loosen this body up. Right now, it's when it's cold like this, everything aches. There's a reason why snowbirds go to warm weather, is everything aches, or it definitely aches more when it's cold. So, if you think about it, it tightens all your muscles up, and then things hurt. Things that wouldn't normally hurt. And that's been part of the issue, I think, too. It's just colder and but okay. Let's hang her up. It's been jibber jabbering for four minutes and thirty-eight seconds here. Alright, bye. It's been about four miles, two hours. I'm having deja vu. It's like I'm in Pennsylvania again. It's just rocks, rocks, rocks. 
not little rocks, but not big, huge boulders either. I mean, yeah. Um, I was mistaken on the campsites, excuse me, the shelters. There's not one at 14. <clears throat> there's one at 21.6, the one I'm thinking about trying to get to. And then there's one, <clears throat> there's one, uh, I don't know, less than a mile now. So it was about five miles from where I was at. I don't think there's one in between. There's a bunch of campsites in between, but that doesn't help me because, I mean, worst comes to worst, I can I can go there. But I'm pretty sure my tent is not waterproof anymore. It was already kind of leaking in one spot if it was a heavy rain. And now it's even worse. But uh, plus it's supposed to be talking about possible thunderstorms. I'd rather just be in a shelter. But 21.6, and I didn't expect these rocks still doing two miles an hour through them somehow but uh that's still uh yeah gotta get the job done i guess it might be late it's gonna be late when i get there if the train doesn't well i think the train's gonna get better that'll help that'll definitely help so all right i'm gonna get moving here <clears throat> i'm gonna get moving because uh the miles don't happen on the road, so. All right, hang her up. Crap, crap, what's going on here? All right, I gotta get moving. Jesus, you guys are just gonna freaking pummel me? Oh my God, they scared the crap out of me. All right, well, I guess they don't need me, good. Four thirty, and I got three miles to go until I hit the shelter that I'm going to. Twenty-one point six miles today. Um, not gonna lie, it took an ibuprofen to get here, but and that's I could have made it without it. It was just would have taken a lot longer. Um, my Achilles and uh, the tweaked ankle. It just keeps getting tweaked and tweaked more and more and more. And it uh, was painful with this terrain. So anyways, I got to figure out, uh, I know what's going on, but I don't know what the remedy is. <laughs> anyways, about 1.6 miles from here, is a campsite that has water supposedly the shelter does not have water which is pretty rare but uh so i'm going to stop at that campsite which supposedly is not even really a campsite anymore but it should still have running water uh via spring so that's the uh plan anyway so should be able to make the destination hopefully uh the rain just doesn't start until I already get there. But, uh, should get there, oh, between 5.30 and 6 is my guess. I was hauling butt just, uh, a bit ago. Get two miles in basically, uh, about 35, 40 minutes. Um, because otherwise it was looking like 6.30. But, uh. All right, I can't uh, haul butt when the when I'm recording, so I will hang her up here and uh, get moving. All right, see you soon. It's 
so strange to have water this high. <laughs> it's just a spring. I don't know. We're super high and we're literally at the top of the mountain right here, but campsite's abandoned, but we got water here. A truck at 1.4 miles, that's not too bad. I'm gonna water up and uh, get moving. Hope I can beat the weather. All right, see you soon. Clearing provided by the power lines, but still something. shelter is but one of the comments saying I had a view or something but I don't know it's somewhere I don't know if it's on that hill over there or what I didn't look uh, <laughs> before I opened up the camera to see where it was uh, it might be up there I don't know I thought it was closer though I thought I was closer to it. I don't see any signs. Anyways, I'm gonna hang it up, figure out where it is, and get to it. It's 545. Do you know where your kids are? Here at the shelter here, and uh, <laughs> ended up Cinnabon was end up here. They didn't push the to town today. So there's a privy here. There's my tent right there. There's Cinnabons right there. There's uh, Vamanos. Vamanos. Vamanos is right here. Uh, so, yeah, there's a bunch of people in the shelter. Um, I don't know who those people are over there or over there, but there's a bunch of people that's in the shelter, so I'm not going to stay in the shelter. If I get, you know, everything gets wet tonight, that's fine. I can dry it out tomorrow. Uh, it's probably going to be raining tomorrow morning anyway, so I'm going to eat some food now. <laughs>